Well, uh, thank you very much. I think I am the last one uh, standing before uh, dinner and uh, more wine, so I'll try to make this brief. Um, I'm very excited to be here. I'm, I'm here to talk about a new book called uh, Future Forward, uh, Leading uh, Leadership Lessons from Patrick McGovern, the visionary who circled the globe and built a technology media empire, uh, my father. And, um, <clears throat> you know, when you think about uh, tech luminaries, certain, certain names come to mind. You, you think of uh, Bill Gates, you think of Steve Jobs. Um, but when you think about Pat McGovern, obviously you know who he is because we've been doing awards with him and he helped anchor this fund. But if you go out outside and ask people who he is, a lot of people don't know who he is, and that's because um, he purposely de decided not to put himself on a pedestal. He decided to let his brands, like Computer World and Mac World and Info World, make a statement, and so he was not known as well. Yet, if you see what he did over the past 50 years, building 300 publications, 460 websites, in 140 countries, in seven continents, having publications read by millions of users every single week for over 50 years. I can't think of another person who has spread the uh, knowledge of information technology around the globe other than Pat McGovern. So I wanted the, the story to be told, and that's what this book uh, does. Originally, it was going to be a biography. Um, and when I went with Glenn Rifkin around the world, he, Glenn's the author, uh, we started hearing stories from IDG employees, IDG alumni. We heard from people here at, um, uh, well, we were at the annual conference in Mumbai uh, last year, and Glenn interviewed a whole bunch of people. And what we heard was that they kept on saying the same stories. No matter what continent we were interviewing people, whether it was in China or here in India or in the U.S., we kept on hearing stories about how he led people, how he influenced people, how he was able to build unique business units and build unique publications um, and build a unique culture in the company. I had the opportunity to speak uh, last week in Boston for about 250 IDG employees. And um, I asked them, how many of you have been in the company for uh, over 20 years? And of those 250 people, over 125 people raised their hands and said, we've been here for more than 20 years. And that's because of the culture. And so Glenn and I started thinking, well, maybe it shouldn't be a biography, a straight biography of, you know, first he did this, and then he went to MIT, and then he started, ID, um, started the company. Um, and so he pondered that, and, and it was my wife, who's sitting over there, uh, Raquel, who said, look, I don't want to know who he was. I want to know how he did it. And so the book is leadership lessons, 10 leadership lessons of how he created IDG over the, uh, over the course of uh, 50 years, uh, and it goes into great, great antidotes, um, and hopefully for all the entrepreneurs uh, out there, it will help you get some ideas of how to lead and build a strong culture. Um, just, I, I'll just go through uh, a couple of titles of the, the chapters, which are the leadership lessons. Uh, lesson number one, have a mission that matters. Let people know that you are on that mission together. Number two, forge a path on the road less traveled. And a great example of that is he went to uh, China in 1978, which would be a best, definitely a first mover status. And uh, he started China Computer World in 1980, well before it was the first Western publisher to reach there. Uh, and of course, very early in 2006, and anchoring, uh, uh, as Sadir mentioned, uh, anchoring the IDG Venture Fund. So great stuff. and. Um, Want to, uh, as, a, as a son, as we were going around, I wanted to make sure that as a nonfiction book, you want to have great blurbs on the back of the book. So I went out and I tried to think of luminaries that I could go and ask to say, would you be willing to be part of this book about my father? And every single person that I asked said, I'd be happy to. And so I just want to read just two quick blurbs here that are on the back of the book. <clears throat> Uh, Patrick McGovern was a gift to all of us, a trailblazing visionary who showed an entire generation of entrepreneurs what it means to be a principle-based leader and how to lead with higher values. And that's uh, Mark Benioff, CEO of Salesforce. And finally, uh, through his work at IDG, Patrick McGovern shaped the world that millions of people grew to understand the enormous potential of computers and how they could change the world. He was known for being a caring and thoughtful boss two traits that extended to his generous 
phil uh, philanthropy. Bill Gates, founder of Microsoft. So I'm very excited about the book. It's been getting great reviews on Amazon, um, and I've been working with Sadir on this, and I'm proud to say that we have uh, books for all of you here. Uh, and so as you're, uh, as you're leaving and, and for food, uh, please pick up a copy, uh, and I hope you enjoy it. <laughs>